Transocean, Sea Drill. These names are titans in the world of offshore drilling. They operate massive rigs extracting oil and gas from deep beneath the ocean floor. For decades, they've been major players in the energy industry. Now these two giants are discussing a potential merger. This news has sent ripples throughout the energy sector. Could this merger create an unstoppable force in offshore drilling? The potential merger raises many questions. What would it mean for the future of offshore oil and gas? How would it impact global energy markets? Let's dive in and explore this developing story. The potential trans-ocean sea drill merger is a big deal. It signals a potential shift in the offshore drilling industry. This merger could reshape the landscape of this vital sector. Why? Because size matters in the offshore world. A combined trans-ocean sea drill would possess a massive fleet of drilling rigs. This would give them significant leverage in negotiations with oil and gas companies. This merger could also lead to increased efficiency and cost savings. By streamlining operations and eliminating redundancies, the combined company could become even more competitive. This is especially important in a cyclical industry like offshore drilling. However, the merger also raises concerns about potential market dominance. Will a combined Transocean Sea Drill have too much power? Could it stifle competition and innovation in the industry? For years, the offshore drilling industry faced numerous challenges, battling both natural and economic forces. Low oil prices, environmental concerns, and the rise of renewable energy sources all contributed to a significant downturn in the industry. Some experts even predicted the end of offshore oil drilling, as many rigs were abandoned and platforms decommissioned. But recently, there's been a remarkable resurgence in offshore activity, with new rigs being constructed and old ones being revitalized. Oil and gas prices have rebounded, driven by factors like geopolitical instability, increasing global energy demand and the need for energy security. This resurgence has made offshore drilling more attractive to energy companies who are now investing heavily in these ventures. Technological advancements have also played a crucial role in this revival. New drilling techniques and state-of-the-art equipment have made offshore extraction more efficient, safer and cost-effective. This has opened up new possibilities for tapping into previously inaccessible reserves, particularly in deep water. The recent Transocean Sea Drill merger could further accelerate this offshore revival, creating a powerhouse in the industry. A larger, more efficient company could be better positioned to capitalize on these emerging opportunities, driving the industry forward into a new era of offshore exploration and production. News of the potential merger sent shockwaves through the stock market. Investors closely watched Transocean and Sea Drill stock prices for clues about the deal's potential success. Initially, both companies saw their stock prices rise. This suggested that investors viewed the merger favorably. The potential for increased profits and market share likely fueled this optimism. However, the stock market is a fickle beast. Uncertainty surrounding the deal's approval and long-term implications could lead to volatility in the coming weeks and months. Analysts are busy crunching numbers and evaluating the potential risks and rewards of the merger. Their reports and recommendations will likely influence investor sentiment. The potential merger of Transocean and Sea Drill presents both exciting opportunities and daunting challenges. This merger could reshape the landscape of the offshore drilling industry, bringing together two giants with a wealth of experience and resources. Let's examine the potential benefits and drawbacks. On one hand, the merger could lead to a more robust and competitive entity in the market. A combined entity would control a larger portion of the offshore drilling market, potentially leading to greater pricing power and profitability. This could also mean better negotiation leverage with suppliers and customers. 
Streamlining operations, eliminating redundancies, and consolidating resources could result in significant cost savings. These savings could then be reinvested into further technological advancements and expansion projects. Combining the expertise and technological resources of both companies could lead to innovations in drilling technology and efficiency. This synergy could drive the development of new drilling techniques and equipment, enhancing overall productivity. Antitrust concerns and regulatory scrutiny could delay or even derail the merger. Regulatory bodies will closely examine the potential impact on competition and market dynamics. Merging two large, complex organizations with different corporate cultures and operating procedures is a massive undertaking. It requires careful planning and execution to ensure a smooth transition and integration. Overlapping roles and departments could lead to job cuts as the merged company seeks to optimize its workforce. This could create uncertainty and anxiety among employees. Only time will tell whether the benefits of the merger will outweigh the challenges. The industry will be watching closely to see how this potential merger unfolds and what it means for the future of offshore drilling. Section 6. What's next? The uncertain future of offshore drilling. The potential Transocean Sea Drill merger comes at a pivotal moment for the offshore drilling industry. This merger could reshape the landscape of offshore drilling, bringing together two giants in the field. The world is grappling with an energy transition, moving towards more sustainable and renewable energy sources. Balancing the need for reliable energy sources with the urgency of addressing climate change is a complex challenge that the industry must face head on. While the long-term future of fossil fuels remains uncertain, the current infrastructure and global economy still heavily rely on oil and gas. The demand for oil and gas is expected to persist for decades to come, driven by industries and regions that are not yet ready to transition to alternative energy sources. Offshore drilling will likely continue to play a role in meeting this demand, providing a significant portion of the world's energy supply, especially in regions with significant offshore reserves, such as the Gulf of Mexico and the North Sea. Offshore drilling remains a critical component of energy strategy. However, the industry must adapt to a changing world. This means not only improving operational efficiency,